From the Sun Bowl in El Paso, Texas, this is at home in the opener, a conference game to North Texas, and then last week at Oklahoma. So three seconds into the game, and UTEP's already burned a timeout. Go for another play on the rollout. We'll tuck it and run and step out of bounds just shy of the 30. Didn't use the lengths as much against Oklahoma. They have their first handoff of the night to Ronald A. Watt. He gets a, we kind of expected a thunder and lightning coming into this season from the, it was just his seventh carry of the season. Yes, it's coming into tonight. Hardison. Finds his tight end, Trent Thompson, dragging a defender into Aggie for UTEP. That play's busted from the start, so Hardison's going to try and make something out of it. One of the returners for this Aggie defense. Here's fourth down, and the pass is caught by Ray Flores for the first down. And Joe. Yeah, Ojo's a really good player. And he ended up missing a 41-yarder. This one is... Up and good last week for 43 yards and an interception at Minnesota. Set up the screen play and it's working well for the Jones. Who Here on the end around. And it's Jonathan Brady all. So Frakes now standing at his 45 yard line. The run that's going to go has room again here. It gets a block from Frakes. Offensive line who got the deflection in the air. And now the Miners take over first off to James Tupo and a late flag. And that is, in fact, the call. So Chris had a personal foul penalty and up near midfield. And Awa, the sideline inside the 30, and he's chopped down just shy of the left in this first quarter. Aggies, or excuse me, at the 23-yard line. Hardison with a long throw across the field to Flores. Felt like it for New Mexico State. Both teams with a cup. It collapsing on Hardison. Goes to the safety valve. Awa makes side across the 40. And... Play action, looking over the top to James Tupo, who's cut. And he has a first down. That is the fullback. And across the middle with knee and ankle. Tupo okay on that one. Here's the first catch of the night from Tyre. Hardison with time on third and five. Looking in the corner for Flores, and it's bad. Heavy package in once again. Play action, Tyron Smith over the middle. It's a touchdown. A lot, but uh, it's good to convert in the Reds play right there and get the seven points. Go to the ground, huge hole inside the 10, Live, dives to the pylon, and he's in. Run right there by Mr. Awa. Gavin Beckley's extra point is through. Off the board, hit it into the half, and really, solid, you know. Uh, they sometimes will be a little generous on these measurables on the uh, roster. I wouldn't be surprised to see it on the ground here. And in fact, it is. But not a lot of room that time. Bro hard on that. Stop. One of the good. And Jerry Kill saying everything he does, I trust. He's the guy I go through. Keep it on the ground once again with eight. Still come out with a four wide receiver set, but they'll keep it on the ground. And now it wouldn't be so. Hawaii, FIU, before the rivalry game against New Mexico. That's the showing a blitz there, although backs off now. Pavia keeps it himself up the middle. It takes a big shot. Look like Blake Thompson on the carry, or the, on the 18 free yards, and a fresh set of downs. He's trying to find the edge here. Takes a big shot. Keep it. Facing pressure. Tripped up and taken. Gahua will get credit for the sack. It's felt here. Only three on this third and long. Westmoreland coming from the backside. Pavia doesn't see it. And he will start this drive at the 14-yard line. Pavia was the first man miss. Cuts it inside the five. And he's in for the touchdown. Touchdown of the season. And through the muff punt, Diego. Up in a bad spot. You fumble it. Now you find yourself in the game. Play action looking for Ray Flores over the middle. But he can't. Another low snap. Hardison now facing the pressure. And he's going to go down for the sack. Could get interesting. Even more interesting here now. Depending on what the Aggie offense can do. They go on the ground to star Thomas. You know, uh, rhythm and, and uh, you know, there's a nice play action pass. No play you action looking over uh, the top to the tight end. New Mexico Military Institute. Blanket. Yeah, he hit his leg. Is uh, Wasn't the plant leg, though. That's true. If you're mentioning their name, it's probably for a bad reason. Hey. A couple guys miss, and he's racing down the sideline inside the 40 it before he's finally. happen. I mean, it's a nice play. Uh, however you can get it, you, you're going you're gonna to want to score here. Well, and this will move the chain. Star Thomas starting to Thomas. Two Juco transfers really impressed during the offseason heading into this season. Here's Pavi. He, he's not a bad. And he's going to the air to the corner, and the pass is he's incomplete. Hang on to yeah. it. His foot was out of bounds. But So now second and ten. This time they keep it. A blocker has some room up across the th 
He's going to do with Smith. Breaks a tackle across midfield inside the 45. Oh, they keep going back to it. It's just they haven't connected. But the, what it says on the back of his jersey, too, instead of his last name. So he throws one to the outside. It's caught by Ray Flores, the Dallas Cowboys. Well, Follow was, him on Twitter. I was talking about the son while he was here. He was just a great kid. The first one, a 29-yarder. And this one is up and right down the middle. So after Oh, there's an end around and a nice tack. Linebacker positions a little bit thin with yeah. injuries and Breon Hayward still trying to deal with the waiver situation. As I so it's first and 10. Get back to the ground game with Star Thomas, who had some success on the last drop. The safety got shut out at Minnesota last Thursday and just six points to show for through three plus quarters. He off the field now and he's exhausted, but he's played a really a, a really good game against the run. Miners showing a blitz and they bring the heat. Pavia has got time though. And he finds his receiver out of Coffeyville Community College. Pavia with time again. And his pass is dropped. You gotta come up with a nice call. Thomas will try to stretch it to the outside. There's a flag that's the outside. He's gonna run right into Tyrese Knight. Yep. And here's Jones on the ground. Eight and a half left to play. I They'll try and right. get it here on third down, and nope. it's gonna be close. Mm -mm. None of that makes a whole lot of sense, especially when it's only fourth and the call. They hand it off up the middle, and it looks like it's enough it yield. But the offensive line answers the call. Red zone just outside the 20-yard line. Star Thomas now in the red zone and looking for more. It's only a matter of time for him before the stats keep coming. Turn away from that one, looking for the oh, pylon, and he's got it. Sure looked like there was a clip right at the end. Yeah, Ethan Albertson had his PAT blocked, and this one is up in through. Nothing to show for it. This one they put in the chest of Ronald Awad, who jumps over a pile. They're coming. Hardison throws as he's backpedaling. He connects with Tyron Smith, but it's... Uh, a, a rookie defensive coordinator is one of the young... And has really given them a spark along with Star Thomas, who gets the first down carry. And he gets up to about... The, or, or tie the game. Star Thomas with a hole. And he's... Seeing a little pressure, but finds a seam and has midfield and he's to the unnecessary roughness on the late quarterback hit. Pavia is hit as he throws. Thomas inside the 10 and in for the touchdown. Handoff is to Jones. There's a flag that comes in. Two of them that come instead of a 10-yard holding penalty. He's 15. It's second and 25. Hule, he dumps it off to star Thomas who territory for the Aggies. Now he's got room to run across the 35 and then take and five, and I'm sure the UTEP, 49 seconds left. They bring pressure, Pavia gets it off in time and it's complete for the first. Nice completion on a slant route to his receiver. You can see the wide receiver coach, Tony, Six seconds to go. Fresh set of downs, Pavia taking a shot in the end zone and it's incomplete, 30 seconds left. Miners bring pressure again. Complete over the middle, it is. Down doesn't really make a whole yeah, lot of difference it, at that point. because the, the, the time. It's remaining for the Aggies. Yeah, they're going to sit back in coverage. Pavia. Yes. Loses Fumble. the football. It's on the turf. Position. And it's the redshirt junior. Victory for the Miners. I know it wasn't pretty. There's going to be a lot of things to correct on the film.